Welcome to Global Feed. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for more breaking updates. Imagine writing a letter, not to a friend, but to someone across a vast dark ocean. You seal it in a bottle and toss it into the waves, hoping it's found someday. That's what we did with Voyager 2, Voyager, a spacecraft launched in 1977, sent to explore the unknown. Its mission, visit the giant planets, then journey beyond, becoming humanity's farthest messenger. Voyager 2 isn't just metal and wires, it's a piece of us, carrying our curiosity and hope. On board is the Golden Record, a time capsule of Earth's sounds, music, greetings and images. It's our cosmic hello, a message to any intelligent life that might find it. Voyager 2's first job was planetary science, flying past Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune, the gas giants. No spacecraft had ever visited all four. Equipped with cameras and instruments, it revealed secrets of these distant worlds. It sent back images and data, showing us the outer solar system as never before. Now, decades later, Voyager 2 has left the planets behind. It's crossed into interstellar space, the vast region between the stars. Its signals take nearly a day to reach us, even at light speed. From this distant frontier, Voyager 2 sent a message that excited and worried scientists. It confirmed something strange at the edge of our solar system. A mysterious, unexpected barrier. What is this barrier? And what does it mean for us? Voyager 2's journey is more than exploration. It's a message in a bottle, tossed into the cosmic ocean. And now, it's telling us what it found at the edge. Voyager 2's journey was a cosmic billiard shot, perfectly aimed. In 1979, it flew past Jupiter, revealing swirling storms and active volcanoes on Io. It showed us Jupiter's moons as a miniature solar system. In 1981, it reached Saturn, flying through its rings and studying Titan's thick, hazy atmosphere. The images were breathtaking. Saturn's rings, Titan's mystery. In 1986, Voyager 2 became the only spacecraft to visit Uranus, discovering new moons, rings, and a bizarre magnetic field. Uranus appeared as a blue-green orb, quiet and enigmatic. In 1989, it reached Neptune, finding the great dark spot and the fastest winds in the solar system. It discovered faint rings and new moons, then left the planets behind. Voyager 2's planetary mission ended but its journey into the unknown had just begun, it was now heading for the edge of the solar system. Why send Voyager 2? Because of a rare cosmic alignment, once every 175 years, the giant planets line up, allowing a spacecraft to use gravity assist, a cosmic slingshot, to visit them all. Without this, reaching Neptune would have taken decades longer. NASA seized this, once-in-a-lifetime chance, building two spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2. Voyager 2 launched first, set to visit all four giants. Voyager 1 took a faster path, but only to Jupiter and Saturn. Voyager 2 completed the grand tour alone. The mission's goal, explore the unknown, answer fundamental questions about the outer planets and their moons. But there was a deeper ambition, to send a human-made object into interstellar space. Voyager 2 was our robotic explorer, pushing the boundaries of exploration. The grand tour was just the beginning. After Neptune, Voyager 2 sailed through the Helio Sheet, the solar system's outer bubble. In 2018, it crossed the heliopause, entering interstellar space. But at the boundary, it found something unexpected, a sudden spike in plasma density and temperature. It was like hitting a wall of fire, temperatures soared to tens of thousands of degrees Celsius. This discovery stunned scientists especially since Voyager 1 didn't find the same thing. The edge of our solar system isn't smooth, it's complex and dynamic. The wall of fire is a thin superheated plasma layer, hot but not dangerous to the spacecraft. Its existence is a major scientific mystery. The edge of our solar system is turbulent and unpredictable, not the gentle frontier we imagined. Voyager 2's discovery challenges our understanding of the solar system's boundary. What lies beyond this fiery wall? What is this strange barrier? Our sun creates a magnetic bubble, the heliosphere, filled with solar wind. The heliopause is where this bubble ends, and interstellar space begins. We thought the transition would be smooth, but Voyager 2 found a turbulent, fiery boundary. Here, solar wind collides with interstellar material, creating a shock wave, a traffic jam of plasma. The result, a hot dense layer at the edge. 
Voyager 2 and Voyager 1 crossed at different places and times, explaining their different findings. The heliosphere may be distorted, changing shape as the solar system moves through the galaxy. This discovery has opened a new field of study, how does our solar system's shield really work? Is the barrier stable or ever-changing? Understanding this shield is crucial, it's our first line of defense against the galaxy. Voyager 2's data is helping us solve this cosmic puzzle. Why does a hot wall billions of miles away matter to us? The heliosphere is our shield, protecting Earth from dangerous cosmic rays. Without it, life would be at risk from high-energy particles. Voyager 2's discovery shows this shield is more complex than we thought. If the boundary has hot spots and thin spots, our protection may vary. Understanding the edge helps us predict cosmic weather and radiation levels on Earth. It's vital for future astronauts traveling beyond Earth's magnetic field. Knowing the dangers at the solar system's edge is critical for safe space exploration. Voyager 2 is our scout, mapping hazards ahead. Its findings reshape our view of the universe. Our solar system is not a calm island but a dynamic, energetic place. Studying the edge connects our existence to the grand workings of the cosmos. What's next for Voyager 2? Its power is fading, and instruments are shutting down. Engineers are choosing carefully which ones to keep running. By 2025 it may fall silent but until then, it sends precious data from interstellar space. Even after it goes dark, Voyager 2 will drift through the galaxy for millions of years. It will pass near another star in 40,000 years, a reminder of the galaxy's vastness. The golden record it carries may outlast humanity itself. Voyager 2 is a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity. It began as a mission to explore and became a journey into eternity. Its final message, a fiery wall at the edge of our home, reminds us how much we have yet to learn. As it sails into the cosmic night, it carries our message. We were here, we were curious, and we looked up at the stars and wondered, 